Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me Good morning everyone. It is Wednesday the 1st of December, which means Vlogmas starts. I am coming to you from the car um, at just before 7am. I have just got my Costa <laughs> and I'm on my way to work. So yeah, I wanted to say a quick good morning. Um, not vlogged on a phone for a long time, so I'm probably looking in the wrong place. Um, but yeah, I have... Um, Looking forward to getting really festive and uh, now it's time to go to work. See you later. So I'm parked up at work now and there's only one way to start December and that is with Andy Williams. It's the most wonderful time of year. Good morning. Welcome to day one of Vlogmas. It's still going to take some getting used to being back in front of the camera, but we are enjoying it so much and it is our favourite season. So we're definitely pleased to be back for Vlogmas again this year. Um, right now I'm heading to the office, so we, um, I am still kind of working from the office, kind of working from home, mixing it up a little bit, um, just seeing how things pan out. Um, but yeah, so today is a work day. I will probably head into town uh, to look at some of the Christmas decorations in town, probably show you some um, of the shop windows and just take you along with me. So yeah, looking forward to getting this day done. It's hump day today, so we're halfway through, getting halfway through the week and uh, cannot wait for the weekend. And just like that, I was saying good morning, and now I'm saying good evening. <laughs> so um, this time of year, you go to work in the dark, you come home in the dark, but um, yeah, good day at work. The first thing we do when we get home is turn the Christmas tree light. I'm gonna start with the Disney tree. Am I gonna just turn the tree lighting on? Hey, has to be the best bit of coming home this time of year in the dark. Okay, so slightly cheating with the lamp on because I can't see where I'm going but I'm gonna switch this tree on. Here we go. And there we are. It's lovely. Love coming home to the Christmas tree. Also just turn the John Lewis lights on so it feels all nice and cozy. Still haven't updated this, so obviously it's less than 34 days, but I need to update so this. We had a couple of deliveries um, in our food shop last night. Um, we got the roses and we got celebrations so the Christmas staples have started to arrive and also one more thing got delivered today I'm going to show you the now. Snowdonia cheese so if you've watched our vlogmas before you'll know that we normally get this cheese from the Windsor farm shop it is the best smoked cheddar um, from Snowdonia cheese company so we actually got this on Amazon this year and um, got delivered today two of them for £9.50 here he is it sucks for his annual Vlogmas appearance. <laughs> you ready for your dinner? Yeah, he's hungry. I can finally capture them both. She's just had a biscuit, but there's Willow. Hello. 
You've just been eating your biscuits and they're both happy with her cat feeding time and they've got their own little cupboard now in the utility room with all their Shebas and the Dreamies that are well, up, well and truly hidden at the top. And we've got their Christmas Dreamies ready and they've got their little Christmas bowls which we got from Home Bargains, I think. These little Christmas cat bowls were from B&M. They were two pounds, which I think is really good value. And they say cat's Christmas dinner and they've got all of the little cats around the outside. It's really cute. So we'll save those. I'm not sure Christmas. if we showed the Christmas decorations in the kitchen, but we've got the Mickey wreath from Primark. We've got the bottle, just there, bottle little jumper. We've got these cute little um, candle holders. There's one snowman there. This Whiskey New and Merry Christmas was from TK Maxx, Home Sense, and I think it was like 5 99 but that's nice. And then another little snowman there. It's a nice little display. So I'm not sure about you, but we're doing a bit of a, a hybrid. Um, so we both kind of work three days a week in the office and two days at home. So it's a mixture. It's quite nice to be in the office. It's also quite nice to be at home. So it's working quite well for us. So I got home first, just waiting for Rich to arrive. It feels really strange talking to a camera again. <laughs> so um, thank you for the kind comments so far. It's been lovely reading the comments for the first vlog. Um, I've just been tidying up, fed the cats, um, checked all the packages we've had received. So today we've had like super drug, a lot of Black Friday stuff. So we did some super drug, Amazon, Boots. Um, so yeah, it's nice getting all the parcels. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're gonna have Get Rich home, have dinner. Um, Rich is home next two days, so hopefully it'll be a bit easy for him. Um, and um, yeah, have a nice evening. Got lots to say tonight. Soxy. Oh yeah. And he's had his dinner and everything. So we're just chilling, looking at the fireplace, and Sox is just singing to me. There we go. Hello, <laughs> guess who's home? I'm home! <laughs> and... Oh, I long for this moment every day. Who have you got? I've got Willow! <laughs> hey, look at girl. She's having a little cuddle after oh, a long day. This is what we do every day. We have a long cuddle. Yeah. She likes her fireman's carry. And you can preview the, the mug cupboard because you can kind of see it. <laughs> but it hasn't got many mugs in it. Yet. <laughs> Yet. It needs to have more mugs. It's not as big as the other mug cupboard. We need to sort that out. There's major improvements needed. Fun stuff for a weeknight is dinner. Salad. <laughs> <laughs> but just before we start, can I just point out how cute this um, little tea tray is? Um, this was from HomeSense. Yeah. And I know that the the little cat and the little brown cat looks like a willow, and the little black cat needs some white. But we kind of thought it looks like willow and socks. It's and close enough. <laughs> had to get it. <laughs> so we're having salad tonight. Um, you're adding. So the plan was to get salmon flakes from Asda, but they didn't have any. So I had to nip to m and today and got <laughs> trout. Trout. <laughs> it's Sorry, close just... enough. Salmon, <laughs> trout, it's close enough. And I've got the orzo and slow roasted tomatoes. We've got some mixed grain salad. The light's not great. Um, coleslaw. And I want to show you our favorite bit of thing that we've always wanted to have. And it was a garage and it was an American fridge in there. So we've got to show you this fridge. Perfect. thing. We've got the Merry Christmas rug that leads to the garage. Okay, so the simple things. <laughs> the <laughs> simple things. The garage, the garage. that uh, needs sorting it's out. It's work in progress. It's a work in progress <laughs> right now. We've only, you know. Mainly like, Christmas it's stuff. It's mainly Christmas stuff, yeah. But, and drinks overflow. Yeah. Because we've just got drinks. We're prepared for, for Christmas. Christmas. And then this in the fridge freezer. Are we really doing this? Yeah, this, this is like <laughs> <laughs> the best purchase we ever made. And it mainly is a drinks, this one is a drinks one. Yeah. Because the kitchen one is, more um, for like everyday stuff. Yeah, like food. food. <laughs> this is all drink. So we've got like, Rich has got his guava. Rubicon. Rubicon guava. We've got Tizer ready for Christmas, if you remember last year. Yeah. Most drinks are for Christmas, really. You've got Rubicon. I love my Fanta lemon. Uh, we've got some Starbucks um, Christmas drinks. And then here, a lot of this <laughs> is stocked up for Christmas, but that is a Cheesecake Factory cheesecake there from Costco. Oh yes, for Boxing Day. <laughs> yeah. Day after Christmas Day, yeah. Um, we've got various things in here, but mainly like ice cream. We found those over the summer. <laughs> <laughs> um, so various cool things all stocked up. But this was kind of one of our really exciting purchases for the 
New house. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Needs must. And it says the temperature on there, which I yeah. think is so cool. I have just put the batteries in, because we forgot to do that. We put all the, the chocolates in, but forgot the... Oh, priorities. <laughs> <laughs> so let's have a look. If you remember this one from last year, it's just the musical amazing one. Do I get the... Um, you get the honour. Do you I do get the honour of doing number one. Door number one. Ah, oh, isn't it lovely? Well, this isn't on right now. They're all sitting there waiting to dance. What chocolates do we have? We have lint. Lint chocolates today. Lint chocolates. There we go, day one. What did you find in TK Maxx today? <laughs> it was a Ray Dunn find. So, they are, is it candy cane? Yeah, candy cane soaps. And it comes in a lovely little dish. Like it's a ceramic fun. dish. And it says soap on it. Yeah. And why did you buy it? Because it looks good and we like Ray Dunn. <laughs> <laughs> It says happy holidays and it was 7 99 And it was the only one that wasn't chipped. <laughs> yeah, this this one looks... looks Which, like I don't know if it's a sign that it's not going to be but quite durable, I don't know. We'll see. Good find. And then you're going to open your advent calendar now. Yeah. So we're not going to open these advent calendars every day because it's just chocolate and you may well have the same ones. But um, we got these ones from Hotel Chocolat. Rich has gone for the caramel chocolate. Of course. And I've gone for the milk chocolate, and it kind of previews you to what you're going to have in there. It was the night before Christmas. 24 Christmas sculptures, uh, sculptures cast in 40% milk chocolate. So they look cute. And in Rich's one, pretty much the same, but just caramel. So we're going to enjoy these each day. So I've done my caramel one, and it's so small. <laughs> They are quite small. I'm not going to show them every day, but I just wanted to show you how small they were. But delicious. We thought we don't really do TikTok, but we do watch TikToks, and we thought we'd just do one each day. And this one is the Sean Mendes song, and it's just so funny. This really makes Rich laugh every time. <laughs> Good evening. So we are working our way through our advent calendars, and if you've watched previous Vlogmases, this is this year's uh, parcel that's arrived from Genevieve. Yeah, our lovely friend Genevieve in New York. Um, I don't know how many years this has been going on for now. I would say three or four years. Yeah, and um, Genevieve is uh, on Instagram, and I love her Instagram, um, at Gift Guider, and I'll link below. Honestly, the handwriting. <laughs> this, every single part of this is beautifully done. So. Look, some... Uh, Fir, some um, fir, I don't know what that's the technical name, fir tree. Um, We've got some berries, berries and look at the bow as well and the L and R on the box. It's, I don't want to open it, it's I know, so it's nice. so nice. And then what, what happens is every day there is a numbered gift for every day. Yes, we work our way through and there's clues. It's quite so we'll exciting. we'll start with the card. Yes. The cutest kitty card <laughs> oh, on the back. <laughs> <laughs> so Willow and Socks will be seeing that. Yeah, and Genevieve has put Merry Christmas. Hope you enjoy this. Can't wait to see your reactions when opening. Also, anything with a red envelope is fragile or do not bend. Um, so let's crack on. Have go. a go. This is it. <laughs> it begins. It begins. So we're gonna find number one and we're gonna join you on the sofa. Good evening. Oh, it's nice to be on the sofa all snuggled oh. up. <laughs> I've got the Ray Dunn um Christmas blanket and I've got the be merry Christmas blanket. Yeah. This one's yeah. got all like nice stockings on it and it's such nice material. Oh, it's so warm. <laughs> so I think these are like twelve ninety nine from either TK Maxx or HomeSense. Yeah. They're quite hard to get hold of. Yeah. We promise we're not TK Maxx HomeSense sales reps. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> we just love their stuff. Just love their stuff. Yeah. Um, and obviously it's Ray done. Yeah. Yeah, so we have had, um, it feels weird because we don't see each other all day. I don't know if you guys are the same, but how's today been? Chaotic. <laughs> <laughs> But we're we're past like the middle of the week. It's like, like the weekend is in sight for me. What about you? Same, yeah. same. Yeah, it's hum hub days over. Um, thank you so much for all the lovely comments. I know I said it earlier, but like it's been so lovely. Even at work, I've seen them coming through. So thank you so much for everyone who's commented on the the first vlog. Yeah, and it's so nice to see so many familiar names. Like obviously we haven't put a vlog out for eleven months and. You just remember all the names of um, all the lovely um, Disney friends that have commented before and, and you know, been following us for a long time. It's nice when you see comments like, it's like seeing old friends and just, it's just been the sweetest. So much kindness and just thank you so much. Yeah, so we just want to have a look at a few questions that came up in, in the um, comments. So yeah. we had one question around, how did the cats react to the move? 
Um, they got there in the end. I mean, they are getting quite old now, sadly, but they've had a very happy life. Um, but they, they're adjusting now, aren't they? Yeah, it was quite traumatic on the kind of run up because obviously we packed everything up and then they clearly knew stuff was going on. Yeah. Uh, we used storage, so we were moving stuff out for like weeks before to get it kind of less stressful. Yeah. And then on the day we closed them in a room and then obviously got them in their carrier and then we had to obviously, we um, completed on our sale and then had to wait an hour to complete on our purchase. Mm -hmm. So they got to sit in the car with us in the car park, um, just sort of talking to them, calming them down. I had to go and get the keys from the estate agent and I had to leave you with them. And oh, it was such a stressful experience, but so worth it. It is always worth it in the end, isn't it? Yeah, but they're loving it now. They're, yeah. they're used to it now and love exploring them. Lots more space, lots more rooms to explore, but yeah, they're having a well of a time. <laughs> <laughs> so they'll definitely be featuring in the vlogs as you would have seen today. Yeah. Um, we got asked any travel plans soon? We're always thinking about traveling, aren't we? Honestly, it's probably the thing that's on our minds the most every day. Yeah, we're definitely hoping to get back to Florida and Walt Disney World in 2022. So we're not doing it at the end of Vlogmas because I know a few people have messaged like, are you going to be going to Florida like on the 24th of, of December or whatever? Uh, unfortunately not this year. We'd love to say we are, but no, <laughs> yeah, we're not. Genuinely not. <laughs> genuinely There's no surprise. Not. No surprise. Um, but definitely in 2022, subject to things staying positive. Um, it's great to see so many of you, especially on our, our Facebook group um, that are out there now or you've been back out there. Yeah. Um, I think we're going to cry, but yeah, we're ready for tears. Also, prepared to see how different it is. You know, Fast Pass Plus is gone. There's Genie Plus. There's Lightning Lane. All these new terms to get it, used to. <laughs> is it going to be worth it? Because it's not cheap. It's uh, probably the most expensive it's ever been. Yeah, flights are the most expensive. So, yeah, we're hoping that we feel that magical feeling. Car hire. Yeah, it's car, so expensive. Let's not talk about car hire. Car hire. <laughs> Let, it's a completely different topic. <laughs> Yeah, car hire is crazy, <laughs> but um, yeah, we hope to share soon. But we probably we probably won't pre-announce anything if we if we do get to go. Yeah, we'd rather just say when we're on the plane. <laughs> Wheels up in the air. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, there was a couple of questions, and we also got an email, and um, we just want to say we don't have a PO box. We closed it a couple of years ago, but we do have an email address. And last year we got so many lovely emails. Lots and lots. Yeah, it was lovely. Um, and our email address is dreaminglr at gmail.com and I will link, we will link it below. Yep. But we had one email from Sharon and she just said, um, super excited to see your gorgeous faces. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> um, and that was from Sharon, Tiana and Brielle in Australia. Wow. Hello so, to Australia. Hello to Australia. <laughs> um, so yeah, we would love to see your Christmas trees. Um, Last year, I think we saw so many amazing Christmas decorations and Christmas trees. So All of them very impressive. And it actually, we said to each other that they actually gave us inspiration because moving house has been on the cards for a while and seeing everyone's Christmas trees and all different designs was like really inspiring. Yeah, it So was. well done, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to go back to Genevieve. We found parcel number one. Yeah. Rich is going to open it. Because Luke said he wants to do odd numbers. Uh, no, even numbers. So I'm doing the odd numbers. That's how we've done it this year. Yeah. <laughs> so it's got a red part. So we're just going to open it. Want to show what it looks like? Oh, yeah. Number one. Go, number one. So we'll come back to you on the phone. Rich has opened the card. Okay, so I've just realised that I need to read the note and you need to open the present. Okay. Okay, so what item can be found in abundance inside Luke and Rich's cupboards? I think a lot of you will know the answer to um, this. <laughs> I've got a lot of food. <laughs> um, so what item can be found in abundance in, uh, inside Luke and Rich's cupboards? Okay, guys. <laughs> okay, I think it's a mug. <laughs> yeah. Let's see what mug it is. Hold on. It's a Disney mug. It is. <laughs> How cool is this mug? Um, it's got I Mickey Mouse it. and it's got a, a Christmas um, hat topper on it. I love the drawings on the side. That's really cool. I love that. I absolutely love that. Oh, that's Thank amazing. you so much, Thanks, Genevieve. Genevieve. Thank you. Um, we were just talking earlier about the mug cupboard looking empty, and now it's yes. got an amazing, a perfect addition. I love this game. <laughs> and Mickey Mouse as well. Perfect for Luke. And I love Mickey Mouse as well. <laughs> Thank you. And if you remember, we did the quiz, the Advent quiz. 
the quiz is coming back. There it is. We found it, it didn't go missing in the move. So today's question, and, and with the way we play, if you're new to our channel or new to Vlogmas, Rich reads the question out, you comment, and then tomorrow we give the answer. So, yeah, here we go. This is up in our Disney knowledge, because you never know when you're gonna be in that quiz. Okay, so the question today is, who debuted in an animated short first out of Goofy and Donald Duck? Oh. Hmm. Do you know, know the answer? Goofy or Donald Duck, who debuted first in an animated movie? Oh, I know the answer now because I've just read it. <laughs> <laughs> Luke's just read the answer, so you're not allowed to comment. But if you do know the answer or want to have a go, drop a comment below. Yeah, and also let us know below what advent calendars you've got this year. I know we have a few. We've got the Fortnum's one, we've got this one and we've got our chocolate one, but you've also got your tea one, which you've totally forgotten about. <laughs> I've just remembered the tea one. <laughs> so we'll find out what tea Rich is getting. Um, but yeah, let us know. For us, it's always been a tradition to have an advent calendar or two. Yeah. Um, or three. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but I hope you guys like the Disney quiz one. Yeah. Um, but yeah, do you want to go, should we go and see what tea bag? Let's go and Let's see. Let's go see. <laughs> so, the Fortnum Mason's tea calendar, <laughs> which I think design-wise was the same as last year's. Um, Rich loves this calendar, it's been going on Why are you giggling? It. <laughs> it's been going on about this calendar, we've had this calendar probably for like two months, the minute it came we out, have, the yeah. minute it came out it was ordered. Um, so, window number one. If anyone else remembers have? how we say <laughs> Echinencia. Echinencia, yeah, I wonder if it is, hang on. Right, today's one oh, is... Echinacea. Is it Ro Royal Blend? Yeah, Royal Blend. Okay. So it's not just any blend, it's a Royal Blend. <laughs> Smells nice. So yeah, that'll be my tea for the morning. Yeah, we haven't been to Portland's. We did an online order, but we're hoping to get back yes. to Portland soon. Hopefully, watch this space. Yeah. <laughs> so I hope you've enjoyed day one of Vlogmas. Um, normally, we come home, have dinner, and go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> so, so this is quite out of the ordinary for us. And Minnie's a little bit lopsided there. Sorry about that, Minnie. <laughs> no, but we like interacting and we said through Vlogmas we may not be able to do it every day. Um, some days we might just do a live, like yes. a, a YouTube live. But yeah, tomorrow we're doing something more exciting. In the, We're working, but after work. <laughs> um, there might be an appearance from a familiar face. Maybe. Yeah, and maybe a bit of shopping. Maybe. Um, <laughs> probably predictable. Guess is below because yeah. we're quite predictable in Vlogmas. Yeah, guess below. Yeah. Uh, where are we going tomorrow? <laughs> um, but yeah, no, see you all tomorrow. For more vlogmas. See you then. Bye. Bye.